sis, do you think you could make me a dress for the Halloween dance? I was hoping to go as a princess. Every year you go as a princess for Halloween. Can't you think of anything else you'd want to be? Why would I want to be anything other than a princess? Oh, I don't know. Maybe it just gets old after a while doing princess every year. Well, not everybody can be like you, Poppy. What do you mean by that? I mean, you're always coming up with awesome ideas. Well, why don't you just let me come up with an awesome idea for your costume? No, I think I'd feel more comfortable being a princess. You're so predictable, Holly. How about you go as a bee? Are you serious? A bee? How would I look cute as a bee? Well, you do sort of wear a tiara every other day of the year, so maybe during Halloween you could try something new? I'm just saying. Well, let me know when my princess dress is ready. Thanks, sis. Ugh, she's going to drive me crazy. Oh, Rover, you're such a cute dog. I just love you. Would you like some food, buddy? Well, I'll take that as a yes. Let's go get you some food. Maddie, do you have any plans for the Halloween ball? Do you have a date yet? No, not yet, but there is this boy that just transferred from Italy and I think he is so cute. His name is Gable. Well, are you gonna ask him out? Well, I really want to, but I, I am a little bit nervous. I mean, what would I say? Just ask him. I mean, you're not gonna know what his answer is unless you ask him. Yeah. I suppose you're right. I will. Next time I see him in school. All right, well, let me know how it goes. Hi, Gable. Hi, Halloween. How are your classes going so far? Is it tough being the new kid? Oh, they're going okay. I'm still a little bit lonely, though. I think people are afraid of me, since I'm from so far away. Oh, you'll fit in just fine. It just takes some time for people to warm up, I think. Yeah, I suppose. Hey, do you have a date for the Halloween dance yet? No, I hardly know any girls that I would even ask. Well, would you like to go with me? Oh, that would be wonderful. I don't see why not. When is it? Oh, it's this Saturday. Would you like me to pick you up? Oh, that would be wonderful. How about 7.30? All right, great. I'll see you there. Bye. Hey, Gable, wait up. Oh, hi, Maddie. How are you? I'm really well. I was wondering if you'd like to go to the dance with me on Saturday. Oh, I'm sorry. I already have a date. What? But you just got in town. Who are you taking? I'm taking Halloween. What? Halloween? All right. Well, do you have any friends that would go with me then? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I don't have any friends yet. I just got here. All right. Well, maybe I'll still see you on Saturday at the dance. Bye. Well, that was weird. Huh. Hey, why did you do that? You know exactly why I did that. Maddie, are you still taking your pills? Pills has nothing to do with this. Then why did you just shove me to the ground? You asked Gable to the dance on Saturday, and you knew I liked him. Never once did you mention that you liked Gable to me. How would I know the way I look at him in class? I really don't study your face in class. Well, you should. 
Tell him you can't make it. I'm not doing that, Maddie. Get over it. Helene, this is serious. If you don't tell him that you can't make it to the dance, I am going to dun, 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 ruin your life. Maddie, you can't just ruin somebody's life because they're going to a dance with somebody you like. And you should have just told me that you like him. Well, ugh, ugh. well, you should have known that I liked him from the way I looked at him. Don't be ridiculous, Halloween. I don't study your face. Exactly. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You just are so difficult sometimes. I don't know how anybody can deal with this. Rover, are you supposed to be up on the table? You know you're supposed to eat on the floor. All right, if you really want to eat up on the table, I will go grab your food. There you go, Rover. Now you can eat on the table. Oh, Rover, you're such a funny dog. what Halloween did. Why, what did she do now? She asked Gable to the Halloween dance. Can you believe that? Oh, I'm so sorry, Maddie. I'm sure she didn't know you even liked him. You're supposed to be on my side. I am on your side. Have you thought about asking someone else? No, there isn't anybody else I would want to go with. Well, why don't you just join Poppy, Holly, and me? We are all going without dates. We are even planning a scary movie sleepover afterwards. Well, that does sound like a lot of fun. Does that mean you'll join us then? Sure. Do you know what you're wearing to the dance yet? Not yet. I'm not sure if I will wear a costume or not. Are you planning on wearing a costume? I'm not sure yet. We should go shopping and find something to wear. All right. Sounds like a plan. All right. Bye, Piper. All right. Now, where did I put my book? Is that my new princess dress? No, it is your bee costume. I thought that's what we decided on. I hope you are joking. I want to look perfect for the Halloween ball. Yes, I am working on your princess costume, don't worry. Why are you trying to look perfect for the dance anyways? Well, if you must know, I am hoping that Dexter will finally notice me. Good luck with that. I'm pretty sure he's going to the dance with Raven. I noticed they are always talking together during lunch break. You let me worry about Dexter and you worry about my dress being ready on time. You can be a real pain in my tush sometimes. Oh, I know, but you still love me. Thanks, sis. <laughs> Hello? Oh, hey Jane. Oh, nothing much. Just window shopping on loveandharmony.com. Do you have any plans for Saturday? Are you going to the Halloween ball? I'm sure it'll be pretty lame, but I'm still planning to go. Ooh. Oh, nothing. I just came across a super cute guy's profile. Oh boy, I'd really like to get my claws into him. All right. Well, I should probably start working on my homework. All right, bye, Jane. Forest ranger looking for love. Hobbies, track, jogging in the forest, howling at the moon, looking for a girl with the heart of a wolf and enjoys staying up late. Status, not looking for anything serious, but if I found someone, Clossum, I would be over the moon. Oh my ghoul, 
He sounds so dreamy. I better hit the interested button on this one. Hmm, I wonder where he's from. I'm so glad you're home. You are not going to believe what happened at school today. What are you working on? I believe that's none of your business. You are not going to believe what Maddie did to me at school today. What did she do now? Guests. Did she open the stall while you were peeing? No. Lit your hair on fire? No. Filled your locker with manure? No. Pulled your pants down? No. Replaced your lip gloss with magic marker? No. I give up. What did she do? I was just walking to my locker when all of a sudden Maddie shoves me to the ground. Can you believe the insanity of this girl? Well, did you deserve it? Of course not. Well, what did you do to make her so mad? I didn't do anything to her. Well, you must have done something to provoke her. Even Maddie wouldn't shove someone to the ground for no reason. She's mad at me because I asked Gable to the Halloween dance. And I take it she likes him? Yeah, I guess. Well, did you know that she liked him? She never told me that she liked him, but I could kind of tell from the way that she looked at him in science class. Well, then maybe you did deserve it. Oh, I'm kidding. I say forget about Maddie and plan on having a good time at the ball. Not everyone has a date, so just enjoy yourself. You're lucky you have a date. Are you going to the ball this year? Yes, but I'm probably not going to stay very long. All right, sis. Well, maybe I'll see you there. Try not to embarrass me. Maddie, are you planning to go to Halloween's party tonight? Yes, I am. But I thought you were mad at her for asking Gable to the dance. Oh, I am. I'm still working on a plan to convince Gable not to go with Halloween. What kind of plan? Don't worry, Piper. I have it all under control. Oh, it does worry me, because some of your plans don't usually end well. That is why I can't tell you, because I know you will try to stop me. Oh, Maddie. Come in! Oh, hey, Jane. Hi, Howleen. Claudine's in her room still. You can go in there if you want. Okay, thanks, Howleen. I wonder when everybody's gonna get here. Come in! Oh, hey, Poppy. Hey, Holly. Thanks for coming to my party. Everyone else should be coming very soon. What movie will we be seeing? Well, I was gonna wait until everyone arrived, but I have Twilight, Frights Camera Action, and Frozen. Do you guys have a preference? Frozen is the best movie ever. I would prefer Twilight. Oh dear, this might be a little bit more difficult than I thought. Are we going to play any games? Or maybe makeovers? Well, there's some food on the table if you guys want to go sit down. All right, come in. I brought my dog, I hope that's okay. Rover, come here. Hi, Cedar. Yeah, that's fine. We have a dog, too. Maybe they can play together. Oh my gosh, who let this dog in? I didn't know there was going to be dogs here. Shoo, shoo. It looks like he really likes you, Poppy. Yeah, I can tell that. Please get him off of me. I'm starving. Is there any food here? Yeah, make yourself comfortable. There's some fruit on the table. And I'll have popcorn later. Oh, thank goodness. Do you know if Maddie are planning to come to this party? Maddie? Who's that? Um, your roommate? Yeah, I don't know. 
I think they were talking about it when I left, but I'm not really sure. I can call them if you want. No, that's okay. If they come, that's fine. All right, now where is that food you were talking about? My goodness, she's kind of weird. Hey, Claudine. Oh, hi, Jane. What are you working on? Oh, just some homework. <coughs> so did that hot guy from Love and Harmony ever contact you back? Why, yes, actually he did. I'm thinking of meeting him at the dance. That doesn't sound safe at all. Then he will know what school you go to. I suppose you're right. I was thinking there would be a lot of people there so I would feel safer. I think it is super scary to meet someone from the internet. I mean, what if he is a serial killer or he's just super old? Well, I've talked to him over the phone, so I don't think he is very old. What? You gave him your phone number? Well, does he seem nice? He's kind of quiet. It's a bit hard to get him to open up to me. Sounds like he has secrets he's hiding. Oh, Jane, you're such a scaredy cat. Where is he from? What does he like? He is a forest ranger and enjoys jogging. He was on the school track team in high school. Was on the high school team? How old is this guy? 19, only six months older than me. You know his birthday? We talked a lot last night on the computer and then on the phone. I really hope his photos are real. Well, I wouldn't get your hopes up too much. I'm pretty sure most of the people on there probably lie and post fake photos. I sure hope you're wrong, Jane. He sounds just perfect. Come in! Come in! Did you hear what Maddie did to Halloween the other day? Yeah, I can't believe that she came. Do you guys think there's gonna be a fight? Oh man, I hope not. Well, I kinda would like some drama since we're gonna have to watch Frozen. Hi Halloween, how are you? Oh, I'm good, Piper. Thank you for asking, and thanks guys for showing up to my party. I wasn't sure if you guys would make it or not. Hi Maddie. Hi Halloween. Please tell me that we're not going to have to watch Frozen again. Well, some of the girls really would like to watch that movie again. Would you be okay with that? Well, I guess, as long as there's some free food and some soda. Yeah, sure. Help yourself. It's, it's in the living room. I'm going to go grab some more food in the kitchen. You guys can start the movie if you want. Where were you, Maddie? I went to the bathroom. The bathroom isn't over there. Don't worry, Piper. I didn't do anything too horrible. What did you do? Shh. Let's watch the movie. Hey, has anybody seen where I put my phone? Hmm. I wonder where I put it. I thought I put it on the table. Did you guys start the movie? Well, I got some sushi if anybody wants some. Oh, sushi! I love sushi. Bring it on over here, girl.